So it's Valentine's Day. You want to make something special for you and your loved one? Why not try this super fast, delicious, and fresh shrimp dish? It's a stir-fried shrimp with basil, and to serve with it, we're making a really simple shaved vegetable salad with radishes and zucchini. So very thinly shave three radishes and one medium zucchini. I'm using a mandolin to shave my vegetables extra, extra thin and super fast. If you don't have one, you can do this by hand. Just use a really sharp knife and slice everything really, really thin. Then take one medium zucchini and trim it. Make sure that it's washed because you're gonna use it with the skin on. If you do the zucchini lengthwise, it's a little bit more elegant, but you also get a little bit of waste because you can't quite get it all the way to the end, so your choice. Then just set those aside while you get the rest of your ingredients ready for your dinner. And there aren't very many ingredients to get ready. Gosh, that's so pretty, right? Then you need lemon zest, so make sure that you scrub your lemon and then use a vegetable peeler to remove six strips of zest. This is gonna flavor the shrimp. It's a lemon basil shrimp, it's so good. One clove of garlic minced. Mm. You know what's wafting at me right now? Lemon zest smell, it's so good. Make sure it's pretty fine because it's gonna get sauteed, but you don't want big chunks of garlic, especially on Valentine's. You know what I mean, girl? Cut your lemon in half, you're gonna need lemon juice. Uh, two tablespoons is gonna go in the shrimp and more is gonna be used to dress your salad. Whew, that was hard. Now it's time to cook the shrimp. At long last, hours and hours later, minutes later. A tablespoon of olive oil. And my pan is heating already, medium high heat. This dish is designed to serve two because it's a romantic dinner. If you wanted to, you could double it. But I'm using three quarters of a pound of extra large shrimp because I'm only serving two today. Ooh, my pan got a little too hot. But that's okay. I'm not afraid. And the lemon zest. You wanna make sure the lemon zest gets into your hot pan because it's gonna release some aromatic oils and flavor everything, and the garlic. And I'm just gonna bring this lemon over because that goes in at the end. Basically, it is a stir fry, really. But it doesn't have what you might expect to be stir fry flavoring. It's got a different flavor profile with the lemon and the garlic. And it's so beautiful. All right, stop moving it. They're extra large shrimp. They need to sit for just a sec. Be patient. Season it with a little salt. When it seems like it's almost completely done, which is like 20 seconds before it's done, then you're gonna squeeze about two tablespoons of lemon juice over it. When you add liquid to a hot pan, steam is released and you could burn yourself. So I'm gonna totally not be careful and just go ahead and do it. Oh, you should smell this. It's amazing. I'm turning the heat off. And then add the basil. Leave it, dress your salad, come back and toss it. It smells like a garden in here. Use the other half of the lemon, squeeze that. It's a very lemony week. Olive oil, the huge salt and pepper. It is winter, right? Use lemons, they're in season. And then you have a really elegant and different and interesting and fresh salad. So beautiful, right? Don't worry if the basil gets a little bit discolored because that's what happens when it comes into contact with acidity. Oh man, let's see. I'm gonna taste it. A lemony, basil-y. Really unexpected though, too. I think you're gonna really like it. Give that a toss and you're ready to go. Very fast, very romantic dinner. Make your plates beautiful. They're a little unwieldy. But they're so elegant and pretty. A little bit of couscous or other grainy base substance. Orzo would be nice. Regular couscous. This is Israeli couscous. Waftability. Pie. Look at that. Make sure you get some of that lemon zest that was cooked. It's actually quite delicious. Give it a little garnish of fresh basil. Make it look beautiful. Remember, you're serving your loved ones. Beautiful, fresh, fast and delicious, and totally Valentine's Day worthy for your most closest to your heart loved ones. Or the whole family. I mean, I'm not saying that they're not the ones closest to your heart. Of course they are. Happy Valentine's Day. Mmm, <laughs> tasty.